comes to the temperatures and the heat indices, it gets this hot heat stroke and heat exhaustion, well, they become a major factor. Now, there is a difference, though. It all begins when your body temperature hits a critical high. Take a listen. Once you reach that point of 103, you're re really cooking your, the inside of your body. At that point, the most dangerous thing is that you're overheating your brain. So you start not acting like yourself. You start vomiting profusely and not able to drink any water. Now, heat exhaustion has some pretty simple remedies, getting some cool air, drinking lots of water, and using a cold compress. Though when it comes to heat stroke, oh, it's more serious, requiring immediate medical attention. Now, if you have symptoms of heat strokes, a heat stroke like headaches, dizziness, cramps, or loss of appetite, you're urged to call 911 right away.